Hi everyone, so in this video you will learn how to use font awesome icons in HTML. There are two ways to use font awesome icons. The first way is to download it and include it in the project. The second way is to use a CDN link. I will show you both the methods in this video. So let's get started. First of all, we'll try with the download process. Then we'll go with the CDN part. As you can see, currently I'm on font awesome website. Simply click on this button, start for free go down you will find this download button click on it then you will have this button free for web click on it to download you can see the zip file got downloaded now it's time to extract it so let's do so let's extract the zip file inside this folder you will have more folders css gss less metadata a lot of stuff is there but you don't need all these files so simply just select all and keep only css and web fonts and delete others now go in the css folder keep only this all.min.css and delete others so now you have a CSS folder with only one file, all.min.css and we have this web fonts folder. Now just cut this and create a separate folder here. Let's call it a project. Paste it. Now let's open this folder in the VS code. Create an index file index.html. Let's have a basic HTML structure. A div element is required. Style will be text align center. And let's include the CSS file. So it is inside CSS all min.css. Now let's go to font or some website. Click on icons, click here free and open source, pick any icon of your choice, let's go with this magnifying glass, click here to copy, paste it here, save it, now open this file in the browser and that's the output. You can also increase the size and change the color of the icon. Click here. Let's go with this color. Just copy it. Just paste it. And to make it three times bigger, let's use FA-3x here. Save it. Go to browser. And that's the output. Now this is how you can do it by downloading the package. Let me show you how you can do it using the CDN link. So let's go to the project folder. Delete these files because now we'll use the CDN link. To use a CDN link, you have to go to cdngs.com and search for font awesome. Click here. I just copy this. You can see this is the same file all.min.css. Click here to copy the link tag. Go to code editor. Now just replace it. Save it. Now open this file in the browser to see if it is working or not. You can see it is working. So I have shown you both the methods in this video. You can go with the download part or you can go with the CDN part depending upon your requirement. I hope you got the point what actually works. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.